Back in December, I put a piece of advice out and it was titled, do you pave the way or do you get in the way? And what that was around was when people come to you, need your input, need your involvement, are you someone that kind of holds up the process? Or are you someone that gets involved immediately and helps the process move along? Well, today's piece of advice is for the person reaching out, looking to get people to get involved. And if, if you are in that situation, you know that sometimes that uh, can be difficult. People have a lot of things going on. Uh, your email or your request comes in, they intend to get to it, it gets put off to a certain time, and then end result is you're looking to complete your project or move your project forward and you're missing input. So you choose to move it forward and those who were supposed to be part of a process get upset with you because uh, you didn't get their input, you didn't get their feedback, it wasn't included, and then there's some hard feelings. There's a very, very simple fix to this. It's just simply put an end date or a deadline for your request. So what I would advise you to do is when you send out looking for feedback from people or input, just simply say, I need to hear back from you by this date at this time. If I don't hear back from you, I'm going to assume you don't have anything to add or or you know, if it's if it's to finalize or bless the work you've done. If I don't hear back from you by Friday the 15th, I'm going to assume you're okay with this and then I'm going to move forward with it. So now when you do that and the person who didn't get back to you who's holding the process up, they really have no reason to be upset because you've given them the opportunity to input. You've told them if you don't hear back from them, you're moving forward and it really kind of puts the ball fully in their court and takes it off of yours. So that's my advice for you today.